hello everyone welcome back to another video if you're new here i'm queen esther if you've been here from the start welcome back okay so this is just some encouragement this is what i heard the lord say and i pray this video blesses you encourage you lift your faith you know you're probably at some point in your life now or based on what you're seeing you're saying man i don't even know this is gonna happen this is impossible yes it's impossible for you if you try to do it in your own strength but i heard a lot of believe for the impossible expect the impossible mm, let that sink in you don't have to listen to what people are saying to you they're probably killing your confidence making you think that you're crazy or you can't do it but the difference is you have god they just have their own faith their, their own strength and whatever they take from the world this is why we serve the god of the impossible anything you want he can do it he's that big there's nothing too hard for him don't dim your 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 your, your dreams and goals because of what other people input over what you're saying this is why you move in silence with your goals and don't say nothing to people because sometimes the first thing they do is kill your faith oh that don't make no sense oh that's impossible oh you're wasting your time you're not gonna get it no you should go back to work you should do this you know sometimes some of you probably step out in faith instead of they giving you some encouraging word and build your faith they're telling you oh you're wasting your time you better go back to work oh you're foolish you should have never quit your job this and that you know the god you serve right you know what you truly desire. So expect the impossible. Declare it. Speak it. Stand on the word. Not what you think. Not what you feel. Not what people say. But what did your father say? What did God spoke to you? Anything you ask in my name, I will do it. He also said, whatever you believe in your heart, and you confess with your mouth, whatever you believe and have no doubt, and you say it, it is yours, right? Mark 11, 23, 24. And here's the scripture, Matthew 19, verse 26. Jesus looked at them intently and said, Humanly speaking, it is impossible. But with God, everything is possible. Humanly speaking, whatever you're thinking or desiring might be impossible for you or the people around you. But that's not your problem because you, you cast the care on God. You know the God you serve. So don't let go of your dreams. Don't let go of your big goals. That's why you serve a big God. He can do it. Expect miracles expect the impossible expect breakthrough expect favor god carries you you ain't got to stress your life you just have to walk by faith and not by sight oh look at that that just rhymed don't play it, my father you hear me keep pushing keep going you got this god got you he's carrying you hallelujah thank you father lord we give you the glory and the praise because we know that you are the God of the impossible. <laughs> you literally part the Red Sea. You raise the dead. You heal the sick. Now what can't you do? <laughs> you said let there be light and there was. Of course you could bring whatever we want to pass. It's nothing. It's already done. He gave you that thing on your heart anyway. Right? He said delight in the Lord and he gave you the desires of your heart. Think about that. He said the Lord is your shepherd. You lack nothing. He said hallelujah. If you need wisdom, you lack wisdom, you ask him for it. Right? He said all your needs are met according to his riches and glory by Christ Jesus. There's too much scripture to back up what you're trying to do here. Don't listen to the world. The world should have the final authority in your life. Do you hear what I'm saying? Hallelujah. Have you with Holy Spirit. I don't even know how I reach here. But don't give up because of what people say. Don't stop sowing your don't stop sowing seed. Don't stop paying your tithe. Don't stop giving because your family think or your friend think you're wasting money. Oh, and you're foolish. You're just giving away your money and nothing happening. What does the word say? Sow your seed with faith behind it. Lord, I call this seed overflow. Lord, I call this seed. Expect. I, um, I received the impossible. Like, so pay your tithe. The windows of heaven is open your life. When you do these things, just don't do it in fear. Do it in faith. Do you understand what I'm saying? That's God's law. That's God's economy and all the promises he gave you. You have favor. You ain't got no competition when you do stuff and you believe and you live by the word. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He's saying to embrace the new. <laughs> have a beautiful day, heart. What are you saying, Lord? 
He's saying to call on me and I will answer thee and show thee great and mighty things thou knowest not. Whatever you need to know, you ask him. All right? He's saying to take up back the vision he gave you. He showed you that you think it's too big or you think it's too impossible. He can do it. He's the one who's going to do it. When you realize that and you cast a key on him, you'll stop stressing yourself. Let it come to you. Hallelujah. He's saying it's time to elevate in your mindset. Think big. He's God. Nothing is impossible. If he show you something, stop saying, oh, that, that was just probably me or the devil. The devil ain't going to show you nothing. <laughs> if something good, you just receive it. I, well, devil, whatever the devil meant for evil, you should just turn into good because now I've received this thing and I believe by faith, so now I have it. It's that simple. You you make your plan with God and you execute. And, 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 and you do. You do it. Believe for the impossible. Expect the impossible. Thank you, Jesus. We serve a God of miracles. That's why it's called miracle. Big faith. It doesn't make sense, but it happens. Hallelujah. You don't need to be qualified for nothing. God qualifies you. He doesn't call to qualify. Okay? He do whatever he wants. That's why he's God. So whatever he's calling you to do, do it. Whatever desire you have... Don't listen to people and shrink your dreams. Think bigger. Hallelujah. I pray this word blesses you. Have a beautiful day. Stay encouraged and be blessed. Bye. <laughs>